Hi everyone, this is Sonny from Tech Lab in Seattle. I'm sure many of you have heard by now the new Microsoft operating system called Windows 7. Uh, and you may be wondering, of course, what are the new features in Windows 7? And so I want to demonstrate to you uh, a few new features that I find useful. Uh, this new feature, which I really like, I'm going to be calling it uh, docking. This new docking feature allows you to automatically resize any window that you want to take up the entire screen by docking the window that you want to the top of your screen, like so. Um, by um, dragging it to the right, it could automatically resize your screen. I'm sorry, automatically resize your window to take up half of your screen, either on the right or the left side of your screen. You can do that, of course, on two windows here. Um, I welcome this feature um, because most of the time, a lot of times, I find myself, you know, um, copying something from one screen and pasting it uh, onto the other. And so this feature allows you to do that quickly and easily. Uh, I like the uh, new um, Show Desktop feature, which is the, on the lower right corner of the screen. Uh, by mouse overing that, uh, you can now see uh, your background. Uh, by clicking on it, it allows you to access any of the uh, shortcuts and icons that you have on the desktop. Um, I also like the new taskbar, uh, which now shows you um, a live preview of what's going on uh, in any with any running uh, application that you have and uh, any uh, windows that the application uh, has opened. So in this case, uh, uh, with Firefox, I have about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven windows open, and I can easily browse through the seven windows here uh, by simply mousing over uh, the preview. And by clicking on the preview, I can access to um, the window that I want. I also like this new um, shake feature. By holding the window that you want in focus and shaking it, like so, it makes any um, background windows um, disappear. And by shaking again, it brings back. Well, by shaking again, it brings back the applications uh, windows that you have in the background. So I kind of like this uh, new, you know, way of saying goodbye and hello to windows that you have um, open. And uh, I wanted to show you a old trick of mine, which allows you to um, browse through all the windows that you have by holding down uh, Alt Tab. Uh, by tapping, by clicking, uh, by tapping through uh, each of the windows here, I can see the background that the window that I want, and also uh, by uh, navigating to the window that I want and letting go of the um, tab function, a uh, tab key, I can now access to. Uh, I have access to the window uh, that I want. And uh, there is a, on top of that, I, I wanted to show you a uh, 3D uh, preview, which is done by holding down the window and the tab key, which now I have a, um, a 3D preview of all the windows that I have open. Uh, and by doing so, I can quickly uh, get to the window that I want. And by releasing the uh, tab and window key now I have access to that window. And so overall I really felt that Windows 7 made navigating through multiple windows much easier. Uh, and uh, there are many many other uh, features which I find uh, Windows 7 welcoming. But for now um, I'd like to conclude our video today and I hope you enjoyed our short video. And please check out our website at www.techlab102 dot com for more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.